Okay, here we have another tile roof uh, valley situation, I believe. I'm going to open this up and we're going to have a look, see what's going on in the uh, flashing underneath. I see evidence at the bottom of the valley in the eave. There's some damaged sheeting, which means the water's been bypassing the valley flash. And let's open this up and see what we got. Moisture uh, will uh, will uh, attract the ants. They like the moisture. If you can see this here, I'm going to bring the camera up and get a closer picture. But the valley doesn't look that dirty. But when you open it up and look underneath, this is where you see the problem. Uh, I can see here some some water, some water staining in this area where the, where the water has just overflowed the valley, and uh, it's going to be the same all the way up and down this valley. And, throughout the house. This roof's about, oh, I'm going to guess it's about a 15, 15 to 20 year old roof. Uh, this will start to occur, the problems start to occur, uh, I'm going to say around 13, 12 to 15 years, uh, we've seen these kind of issues occur. Again, there's a, it's a single crown valley, so uh, this is, this is what we're, we're up against here. So let me get the camera and give you a close up. So you can see the debris just built up here and it'll be like that all the way up and down this valley all the way up to the gets a little less and less as you go up but we have that here and it's going to be the same issue in the valley on the other side as well let's see if we can zoom out zoom out on the valley there anyway so we have that which either leaks into the house or and or causes uh, damage usually at the bottom of the valley uh, in the uh, in the overhang on the eaves